How to install Android 12 Beta 3 on the Poco X3 Pro. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Android 12 Beta 3 on the Poco X3 Pro. Now, what are the prerequisites for this video? Well, for starters, you do need to have an unlocked bootloader, and then you also need to have a custom recovery installed, and you do need TWRP for this specific build. And of course, videos on how to unlock the bootloader, how to install TWRP recovery, can be found in the description of this video. Another thing you need to make sure is that your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent. Do not, and I repeat, do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent. Also, make sure you do have a backup of all your pictures, videos, and anything important which you have on your device because we do need to perform a format data. And no, there is no way of installing Android 12 Beta 3 on your Poco X3 Pro without performing a format data. Another thing I would like to mention is that for full disclosure, I do have the international variant of the POCO X3 Pro, but the process and the steps will work even if you have the Indian variant of the POCO X3 Pro. Another thing which I personally recommend is that you should come from stock MIUI for your variant of the POCO X3 Pro. So again, that is my personal recommendation that you come from stock MIUI and how do you go back to stock on your POCO X3 Pro. We do have a video for that, which can again be found in the description of this video. And last but not the least, what are the files which you need? Now, all the files which you need are linked in the description of the video and you need only one file, which is the Android 12 Beta 3 archive file for the POCO X3 Pro. Go into settings, password and security, remove your screen lock, fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done, go back, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done, go back, go into account sensing and remove your Google account. Once you have removed all the accounts and security measures, make sure you reboot your device once. Now, why are we removing all the accounts and security measures? We're doing this because we are going from one ROM to another and I don't want you to be locked out of your own device. Next thing we need to do is boot into our custom recovery, which is TWRP. So for starters, turn off your device. Once the device has turned off, press and hold power and volume up together. Again, press and hold power and volume up together till you see your custom recovery logo. And here it is. We are booting into TeamWin or TWRP recovery because we do have the splash image from TeamWin. So here we are in TWRP recovery. Of course, the version which I am using is linked in the description of this video. First of all, you need to go into mount. Make sure that none of these are mounted. Again, none of these need to be mounted, which is your system, system EXT, product, vendor, and ODM. Make sure they are unchecked. Tap on the home button. Go into wipe, advanced wipe. Select Dalvik data and cache, and then swipe to wipe. Once that is done, tap on the home button. Go into install. Now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the Android 12 file for the Poco X3 Pro. In case you downloaded it on your phone directly it will be in the download folder for me i have transferred it from my computer so it is in the internal storage all you need to do is select this file and then swipe to confirm flash now once the file has flashed successfully we need to make sure there were no errors which might affect the booting process so here it is we are flashing the file and it says here successfully flashed and of course, feel free to donate to the developer in case you want to. Script succeeded, result was one. After that, we are getting errors about failing to mount. Do note, these are the errors which come after we have already flashed the ROM. So you can ignore these errors. Tap on the home button, go into wipe format data, type in yes, and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right of the keyboard. Do note format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures, videos, anything important which you have on your device. And again, we are getting the same error about failing to mount, but, but, but format data was done without any issues. So what do we need to do next? Just select reboot system and there it is we do have the google boot animation on our poco x3 pro which means we are booting into android 12 on the poco x3 pro the first boot up might take some time so you have to be patient 
there it is we are on the setup screen of course android beta program so you will get this message every time you boot into android 12 betas nothing the developer can do about it blame google for this let me skip the initial setup real quick and there it is we have successfully booted into the beta let us go into settings about phone of course this is a port from the pixel 5 let us go into about phone and here and if i tap on the android version bam here it is android version is 12 security patches from july kernel they are using is from oof gang the build number is spb3 which means this is your android 12 beta 3 installed on the poco x3 pro and that will do it for this video Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.